Yo, what is up? What is up, YouTube? This is Godets here. In today's video, I have a brand new episode of GTA 5 Stunt Challenge. And if you notice that little Easter egg in this, in the little race description, let me know in the comment section down below. Anyway, let's get into today's stunt. So this run-up is pretty similar to my last video. It's because I didn't have a ton of time to look for a new spot, so I do apologize about that. But it is an entirely different stunt, and I also noticed in yesterday's comment section that some of you guys said the video was out of sync, so I tried a new syncing method for today's video, and also let me know in the comment section down below if my new syncing method worked. Anyway, it is right here, and I just missed the bump. That is great. So obviously I'm going for that red building right there, or maybe if I'm feeling risky today, try to go for the Penrith building because... That's a little bit harder of a stunt, but I think I'm going to try and land on the very top of that red building right there, so yeah. And basically, if you notice a little easter egg, that was pretty funny. That was an original idea by me. Maybe I'll just start like, putting people's names down there before the end, start of the video. That'll be- Whoa! Okay, okay. Whoa! Oh! Imagine if I would have gone the double bump right there. That would have been sick. Okay, getting the wheelie is really the hardest part about this stun. So if I can do that, I think I'm fine. Let's get off right here. Whoa! 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 Whoa, man. Wow. Let's see if I can stick the landing. And nope, I can't. This is another stunt I don't think I've ever tried before. And that bump is pretty easy considering my first two times trying it. I've been able to get it, which is pretty unusual for a stunt, so I kind of see why people try to take things farther on this clip because the bump really isn't that hard and doesn't affect the stunt that much, so yeah, I think I'll definitely be able to hit it again in today's episode, so we're going to try and land on the top part rather than the bottom part, and well, there's a first time for everything. And also, I can't believe I forgot to mention this in the first few minutes of the video, but someone posted a comment on one of my past videos. It wasn't yesterday's video, but it was before that. And someone sounded, and someone said that I sounded like Phase Apex. So I don't usually watch Apex. So I usually watch like Rain or Adapt. So I went and looked up one of Apex's videos, and sure enough, I actually do kind of sound like him. And I'm not exactly sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I don't know Apex that well. I'm not sure if people like him or not. But even if we do kind of sound the same, like if we were doing a non-like face cam video and you both did it, and you like compared our voices, there wouldn't be too many differences. But with like a face cam video like this, we obviously look a lot different. He has like a freaking like beard and stuff, and I don't have that. Even if I didn't shave for like a month, I probably wouldn't still have that big of a beard. Okay. Oh, this is good. This is good. I wonder if I can go through that little hole right there. That'd be pretty, pretty cool. And nope. I was also talking with some people on Twitter today about what you need to do to be able to play GTA 5 on PC. And because I, I asked that to some people because I do think playing on PC would benefit my videos. Like, they would have better graphics, better recording quality. The stunting physics on PC are a little bit better. Like, even Mafia is on PC now, so I'm really thinking of, like, switching over. Like, of course I'd still play on consoles with my fans and stuff, but I'd, like, consider, like, making PC, like, my main platform, you know. And I died. And I know the majority of GTA YouTubers use PC, so that's why I'm kind of looking into it, too. I could do, like, mod videos, drifting videos, like Erasable Ninja. Except I'm definitely not a Rockstar Editor Pro like he is, so I'm not sure I'd be too good at that, but, like, mods and stuff... I think just like PC would be like a good GTA experience since as it, as GTA's like current state right now on consoles, it's just a little bit boring, you know. And I'm really not entirely sure if I got a far enough run up on this stunt, but I really hope I did because if I didn't, that would suck. I'm not sure if I was supposed to put it back farther or anything, but whatever. And this video will be posted on Tuesday, and I'm also recording on Tuesday, and I'm not sure when this is going to be posted, but... If you're under the 301 club, that's awesome. Whoa. Now, let's see if I can land it this time. That'd be, let's see if I can land it. Come on. Come on. Oh, my freaking God. Seriously? Really? Speaking of the 301 club, it's kind of funny how people still use that, like, term. Because even though about a month ago, YouTube got rid of that whole 301 thing, I guess it's still fun to say, and every single person who posts videos or watches videos will always remember the legend of the 301 views. 
the legend on YouTube that unfortunately ended one month ago because they wanted to provide more accurate view counts and stuff. But I actually think 301 is one of the things that made YouTube YouTube, like, memorable and stuff. I'm gonna miss 301 very much. Through the hole? And nope, it was worth a try. Is this it? Is this it? Whoa, we gotta take this slow. Oh, oh! Oh no, 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 no! Nine minutes? Seriously? Okay, I am counting that. That's not exactly a clip that we were trying to hit, but that was good enough. Oh my god, this is taking 40 minutes. That is long enough. Okay, everyone, that's where I'm going to wrap up this episode of GTA 5 Stunt Challenge. Now, if you enjoyed this video at any point in time, make sure to drop a like on the video, and also subscribe to my channel for daily GTA 5 content. And until next time, this is Gotetsu. I'm out. You guys have a good day. Please be safe, and until the next video.